Okay guys, so today me, Michael, and me are going to a reptile expo. This is the second one. I don't know if I'm gonna get another pet. I'm probably not, cause like my parents don't want any more in our house. So we're about to go pick up Mia. Hey! Ew. <laughs> Dude, I'm so hey. I know, no, I'm good. You look great. And then her cameraman in the back. <laughs> So this one is called Kiradula Venosa from Malaysia, Indonesia. And this is like one of the two mantis in the water can be yellow. One of them is the yellow forehead mantis, but the mantis that is sunny. This is the second one. And only pink. Oh, she's cute. And she has really nice pink and kind of like orange. Oh, she's beautiful. Little colorfuls. Michael, hold a mouse. No. Why not? I don't even like looking at it. I dare you to hold it. I really want a pet mouse. You want to hold it? You want to hold it? Yeah. Okay. I want one, but I don't have a tank for it. They need like a 20 long. So, Michael? Yeah, Hey guys, so we just got back from the expo. <laughs> Um, I'm gonna leave Maya's channel link right here, right? I'll put your video in the beginning yeah, sure. too. But um, Maya did a haul and she also went to the expo with me and we both got stuff and filmed. So here is what I got today at the Reptile Expo. First, I got the Gecko Ledge. It is for Calypso so I could put his food on here easily and hook it up to the side of his tank. Cause I have bottle caps, but I also bought the little cups too. A special shout out to Jay's Exotics and Botanicals. That's how you pronounce them, right? I know. I'm really bad at pronouncing things, but he gave me and Mia our Crested Gecko, so you should definitely check his website out. It's jaysexotics.com. He has a lot of really good stuff. And if I want a gecko in the future, I'm definitely going to him. He gives out really good advice, too. From him, I also got a gecko food storage bottle. So basically, you can mix the gecko food, put it in this, and leave it in the fridge and use it for up to two weeks, the food in there. So all you do is have to squeeze it in the little containers, and it makes it so much easier to use. Of course, I had to get Pangea. So I got the banana and papaya gecko food. So hopefully Calypso is like this, because I know Apollo didn't. I also got this big log for Fitz. This was only $8, and it's like a basking thing. Oh, I think it's supposed to stand up like this. I don't know, but it's really messy, so I'm gonna put it away, but this is that. I also got 250 super worms for only $5. I usually get these, I get like 50 or 20 for like $5, but 250, it's a pretty good deal. So I'm definitely going to be using these and hopefully Fitz will eat them. When I went to the expo, I saw a lot of bearded dragons. They were like kind of huge, but they looked kind of ill. Like some of them had like discharge come out of their nose and they were like real skinny. And then you have Fitz. He's pretty big. <laughs> 
Okay, guys, so I didn't think this many worms. Like, I never thought it would be this much, but holy cow. This is so many worms. So, thank you guys for watching, and stay tuned for the next video. What the heck happened to my face? Oh, it's dirt from Fitz's tank.